Hello, 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 and welcome back again, one and all. I'm Pete, aka Crimson. I hope you're all doing well today. And this, I don't know, it's kind of clear, it's not unpleasant. Saturday. Um, let's play us some Pokemon. How about that? How about that? I fear I am getting a bit of the sniffles. Kind of comes with the time of year, unfortunately, but such is life. But yeah, otherwise, we're pretty good, apart from the giant swathe of dead Pokemon behind us, as shown shaky ground right now, which is why I'm thinking our next plan, to be honest, um, is going to be just to level people up. We don't have... I might have to look it up. Anyone know where we get a Firestone? Because I would really like Firestone. And I don't know. Someone to replace Fruit Shoot? <clears throat> but otherwise, yeah, generally time for a bit of grinding, safety grinding. I reckon getting everyone at least like level 32, which will get Crosswave Evolved, Salad Fork. I don't know if Coraline does evolve. I, don't, I really don't. Um, I'm leaving it that way. It's more interesting, more exciting. But yeah. Um, we do have potential places to go and catch. I don't think we have anybody in here or in the daycare of use immediate use. We only have five Pokemon left. If we wipe, we can't even field a full team for another attempt. Although, if we wipe, it's game over, right, if I recall. You can buy Firestones from the Pokeathlon Dome on Tuesdays. They cost 3,000 athlete points. I vaguely recall the Pokeathlon Dome. Okay. We can't do that today either way. Also, welcome, Spiro. What up, buddy? Um, so, for now, we need to find somewhere to level up a bit. There's the Safari Zone, where we could still go and catch something, or possibly a few things. In fact, that's probably a good plan. I just don't know. I've forgotten the levels of the trainers in that area. What we're going to be dealing with. We should be alright. Um, two to three of each before the Elite Four. Is it different stones on a different day? No other way to get them. Apart from Mom, I guess, randomly, maybe. Answering calls from trainers. I don't... I just keep getting Joey with his Rattata, and I don't care about Joey and his Rattata. Um. Grass flying, I'm going to say. I feel like we should be able to manage this. Probably with just Dragon Rage. Also, I'm thinking Crosswave may well end up being the one in our party to get a lightning attack, an electric attack. I'm trying to... You must be able to get Thunderbolt somewhere, right? Or is it Thundershock? Whichever's the good one. Because we don't necessarily want Thunder. In fact, we, we don't want Thunder. Uh, let's try it. We should have good attack. Monday afternoon rematch. Oh, wait, they're on specific days. Oh, God. I like that system in theory. Um, I was probably on board for it as a kid, playing every day and, and memorizing these things meticulously. I don't know. Maybe we'll take advantage at some point by accident. Or someone reminds me. Because God knows I won't remember. Oh, shit. Well, that's a good start. Mm -hmm. 
That sucked. Quite a lot. Okay. Didn't didn't really need that scare so early in. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this item and we're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center immediately. Revive. Okay, well. Just in case. I don't know. You for now? It's fighting good against normal rock. Dark? Route 36, Wednesday. Okay, so maybe on Wednesday we can get a Firestone. What level did we want to get EV2 before evolving it? I forget. Howdies. Getting better. But yeah, anyway, if Dragonair is 30, then we'll have a Dragonair by that point, which will presumably come with some nice stat boosts and whatnot. Uh... Still got a ways to go though. Damn it. Four fifteen or before forty two. Okay. Yeah, I don't think Ember's worth us bothering with at this point because we're beyond that really being useful. Um, so I guess Firefang is 42. So we could evolve it to at least be useful for now. Caught in Cliff Cave, that's where we got. Ooh, okay. where we got um, a choke. We'll just play it safe. Yeah, that's not going to matter. But yeah, Fire Fang. It's going to be more physical attack anyway than special, isn't it? Uh, Flareon, I would have thought. Definitely before 78. I'd be impressed if we reached level 78. Lava Plume. What, what's the stats on that? got to be pretty good to be learned so late, right? What's the levels for competitive Pokemon? Out of curiosity. Oh god, okay. I wish I'd put... What's it? In the second slot. Uh, everyone gets to 78. Most people at Game Freak have problems. Ooh, okay. Uh, definitely not you, Salad Fork. Twister hits both. Dragon Rage does not. Who are we going to swap Salad Fork out for? Thinking about it. Coraline? Should be fine, right? Can quite easily deal with magma, which means we'll send you an Electabuzz. I reckon. Yeah. That sucks. Crosswave would have just shrugged that off. Oof. Alright. Bold attempt. Quarter damage. Get wrecked. It's 
finish that off before it gets... Oh, Crosswave's going to get a last anyway. Not very fast right now. Uh, could just go for the Surf and heal the Paralysis afterwards. Just going to hit Crosswave. Won't do much, though. But do we dare risk it? Rock Blast. I'll try that. Okay, not going to matter either way. Uh, uncompetitive battles or Pokemon level 50. That's what I thought. Yeah. Applies for Pokemon above 50 and below 50. Everything. Oh, okay. It just adjusts. What just happened? I was reading chat. Holy shit. Guessing it was big electric attack on Coraline. Uh, we're just going to keep going with this. And we are 1 million percent going to be doing the big heal right now. Was a Thunderbolt, yeah. I thought, does, does Rock not defend against it? I guess it doesn't. I guess it's just ground that nullifies. That should be fine, though. That's going to do nothing. Why even bother? Just, just slam. And, I don't know, Rock Blast, because, yeah. God damn it. Okay, I'll have to be more cautious about the old uh, electrics with Coraline then. Lucky to survive, I guess. I have a plume, 80 power, level 71, Flareon learns Fire Blast, 120 power. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because, uh, yeah, I knew Fire Blast was 120. Well, it's not 100 accuracy, is it? So, what's even good about Lava Plume? Whatever. Okay. Please say she's brought me a firestone. Not gonna run back and check, but it'd be nice. If she would. Oh, I need more paralyzed heals. Nope. Because he doesn't learn flamethrower. What's. Is Flamethrower also 80 power? But that's a long time to wait for a Flamethrower replacement. We have Ray Candy. For what it matters. Uh, Flamethrower's 95, so it's not even as good as Flamethrower. Well, whatever with that then. Do that just in case. Oh, it changes. Okay. Guess things do get rebalanced. Yeah, what now? Makes the holder move slower than usual. Okay, so when you want the Pokemon to move last. Interesting. It does look like an Onyx Tail, yeah. You just... Letting a Pokemon hold on to it. Surely. Like, imagine giving that to, like, a Weedle to carry around. Think think of that actually physically happening, not just RPG <laughs> stuffs. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. Double fight again. How are we looking? Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Beheaded. What, you think it's just everything from the neck? Ooh, down. Let me just, uh...
pretty slappy. Bonus of being able to save anywhere. Bollocks is a giant. I get uh. Does a snake crawl around on its neck? Or its body? Or one giant leg? One giant foot? How, how do you... I'm no biologist. I don't know what the official stance is. I know slugs and snails, it's... The terminology is a foot, right? Ice. Ice, good against dragon. Right? I need my... Type chart. Where can I stick this? Right there, I reckon. Oh god. Ice kills dragon, fighting kills ice. Okay. I don't... I don't think I can rely on... Uh, Crosswave going before the cloister. It's the only thing. I don't know if I can take that hit. Could be nasty. So... Ice is super effective on dragon, flying, grass, ground. Not very effective on water. Well, I guess that means, wait. Yeah, crosswave comes out, Coraline goes in. This makes sense, right? Welcome, Sharkers. Everyone loves the feckin' dab. How's it going? Uh, oh, we have Seismic Toss and Revenge. Wait. I haven't actually looked at this guy's moves or anything yet. I'm just going straight into combat. Physical attack, obviously good. Alright. Karate Chop, 50, 100, high crit. Seismic Toss equal to the level. That's right, so that's just naff. Uh, a couple of bad days, Sharkers. A couple of very bad days. Um, revenge inflicts double if you go last. So, Frankie probably gets the lagging tail then, right? We'll give it to him, uh, rather, after this fight, which will be fitting. We'll, in the lore, we'll just say it's that this Onyx's tail, right? If we win and survive. Can hit ghost type moves, All right? I think we karate chop though, right, for now. Back it up. Karate chop! Oh, wait. I should have done it to the cloister. I got distracted looking at moves. Oh, god damn it. No, that isn't. I thought it was sand attack. I got mixed up. Well, it's going to be lowering evasion. That's. Or lowering hit, rather. That's going to suck, though. Oh! Okay. Do you reckon we can safely surf with Coraline? Thinking about it. Gen 5, Sandstorm got a bonus effect. Which is which does this count as? Heart Gold. Heart Gold's Gen 3, right? Or 4? It's not Gen 5, though, is it? Got a bonus effect. Also boosted special defense of rock types. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. This is Gen 4. Yeah. No, that's all right. I need to apologize. Ooh. 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 Harsh. Probably don't have the greatest special defense. Yeah, we go. We're all right. Kill it. Oh, please. Keep going, keep going. 
Beautiful. Beautiful. Right. Which means Frankie auto corrects and hits Onyx, right? Oh, still confused though. Maybe. Yes! Claim its tail. Because looking at it, it looks like everything from, oh, like there down the item. The lagging tail, right? Sorry. Apologies. I'll move it further away. I keep hitting the mic today. Um, right, okay. Item. Give. Lagging tail. Take it. And I guess... Also... While we're here. And then we can have fun with revenge. 48. Have we caught on 48? We have not. We never caught on 47 either. I guess the only option was the water. So we'll try that on the way back. Do we reckon fishing with a good rod or surfing is the better option? Probably surfing, right? Safari zone. What do we get in 48? Okay. Grass flying? Uh, not the greatest, but... Do we reckon it has 40 HP? Could have been a growl here. Fuck right off. Twice now. Sorry, not... Oops. Anyway. Twice now we've missed out on growl here. Favorite Gen 3 mon, Flygon. I don't even know Flygon. Oh, we could have had Arcanine. I never get Arcanine. Denied in two generations now. Krista should be fine, right? I don't want to Dragon Rage in case it actually has less than 40. Do we, t uh, do we take the chance on Dragon Rage? What do you reckon, chat? That can I... Does this work? I've seen it there. It's on the new dashboard, so it's a lot more accessible. Um, wait. Waiting. Fifty HP. Oh, you looked it up. Oh, wait, waiting, drinking. Okay, the minimum it can have is forty-four. I assume negative IVs aren't a thing. So yes, Dragon Rage, basically. Do we even need to... Let's try it. does have 0 to 6, what otherwise it'd have more HP left. Well, good thing we're probably not going to use it, because we already have the grass type at least. Unless it's a really good flyer, I doubt it. Yeah. <sighs> what do we want to call the Hoppet, people? Disappointment? Don't jinx it. No Pokemon is permanent. You're right. You're right.
In that case. What about this chat? What do we reckon? <laughs> How do we feel about that name? It's, uh, it's very honest. Let's be real. Hop it come, if Hoppit comes out the box, we're probably in dire straits, and I'm not just talking about the band. Good band, though. Okay. Obviously, double check everyone's HP every time. Do I even want to see? Damn it! So salty right now. So salty. Unhappy the sequence of events that leads to us having to kill the Growlithe and not catch it. Like... Wish I could say I was just hamming it up. Actually, I'm quite salty. Look at him! He's adorable. Have we even got... Is there, what, what's the odds that we, we'll still catch a Houndoom or a Houndour, whichever one? Yeah, I know. Good move. Owned me. Burn heal. If it had another turn, it would have shed it too. Which is a shame. Exactly 20 damage. 20 HP to heal, rather. Any of you want to fight? What about you, old man? Pokemon drinks? Oh, okay, all of this stuff. Prohibitively expensive, of course. For the best. Otherwise, we'd have to at least consider it right. Anyone else selling? Looking to buy. Got any of the good stuff? Airmail Nest Ball? Weaker Pokemon. At night or in dark places. So expensive. I'll get two. <laughs> Mainly for the caves part. Um, you never know. Quick ball we already have. I think. No, we used it right. Let's get a couple of them. Oh shit, reminds me. We can fly back and... Uh, talk to Kurt on a daily basis now. Also reminds me. Something else I continually forget. I usually remember at least once a stream, but still. Where are we? Hundred percent. This doesn't feel worth it. Rewards not nearly high enough. Seven, the Shelder, Shel Chinchow, Chinchow would be cool, with a good rod, but it's 3% and 7%, come back there later with the super rod for a 60 and 30, okay, where do we get the super rod? Around the Lake of Rage, if I had to guess. the Pokemon Center, which means we can now fly back here, right? So, there's that. 
Need waterfall, okay. To talk to you? Well, talker, all right. Now, I know in Gen 1, we counted each area of the Safari Zone as a separate. So, we have a few chances in here. Uh, does it work the same? I can't even remember how the mechanics go. Uh, have enough RM berries to save that mill tank's life. Oh, wait. I forgot about that mill tank. I completely forgot about that. Uh... Please remind me. In fact, we can get out of this, right, and fly. Okay, fine. He's very insistent. Catch one Geo dude. But I don't want to do that. You have blocks. Right, let's go save the mill tank first. Each block is an area, right, okay. The little tank was here, right? Olivine, just above, just north. But there are a set quantity of blocks, right? You just arrange them. So we'd have to rearrange and exhaust each of the blocks, but we'd still have one catch per area, basically, right? Or is that not how it works? If there's infinite possibilities, we obviously can't allow our, allow ourselves like infinite catches. Just breaks it. Three by three grid. Interesting. Ten different blocks. Okay, so we've got a good chance to restock here. This is a good opportunity. Please tell me I don't have to do this ten times. Oh god, of course I do. 90 different combinations. Yeah, but as long as we use each block, right. We're not, we can't, obviously we're not going to have 90 chances. If nothing else, we'd be there trying to catch all day and surely exhaust our options pretty quickly. But we'll do, we'll do however many blocks we can. Oh. There we go. Seal case. Oh, okay. Oh, that thing. Right. From your PC. Fire seal as were. What? The party seal bees? What? Right. Let's pop back then. Removed it. That's right, I was going to go in here and try it. Okay. Here? No? Bull capsules. Edit. Flora. Party. Can't deposit a Pokemon with seals on the Pokeball. What? So it has to stay in the party if I do this. Wait.
get a preview. Interesting. So what you're basically saying is doing this is just going to be a pain in the ass. Which means I'm not going to bother after all. Alright. It's going to stop me moving Pokemon around. I can't be doing with that. That's just another thing to get in the way at some point. It'll confuse the hell out of me, most likely. Alright, so he wants us to catch a Geodude. Which I guess we could do. But that would give us up a catch. Um, I get the impression we're kind of going to need <sighs> we give up a catch to be owner of the safari zone alright 500 God, we have some money at the moment. Right, hang on. Because it's a 3x3 three three grid, I think it's fair to get nine catches independent of the blocks you set up with the man in red. I was in, this is just our safari zone. We don't get to mess around with that. Because that's also fine. I don't particularly want to spend forever messing around. Rearranging grids. Let's go in. So this is going to be the first area. How... Uh, Alright, poker gears. Nope, it's there. Not helpful. Well, if we see something new before Geodude, we catch that. If I see Geodude, I'm going to catch it. Well, well, pretty happy with that one. Not going to lie. Now I'm super nervous. I was just going to blag it, but now we have this. Guys, guys, how do I... Give me the tech. Give me the tech, because I never understood how to actually do this. I just threw shit and, like, hoped. <laughs> I'm now super nervous of losing this magma. I want the magma. Oh. Uh, bait stops it running right. First turn is pure luck. So we may as well throw. It's low level, at least. Don't run. Just don't run. Jabate it. Jabate it. No idea. Me neither. So this is pretty much how I do it normally. Please don't run away. Just don't run away. Just don't run away. Ah! No. I don't even know how to... I guess we just number these. Well, that sucks. Uh, next area, then. We'll call this area two if we just go anti-clockwise. Not caught an Abra or a Kadabra. We're not going to catch this one almost certainly either, but hey-oh. 
Well, all right. We have a psychic. That's something at least. It senses impending attacks and teleports away to safety before the actual attacks can strike. Teleports a lot. Who teleports a lot? Psychic teleporting. What am I? Something that's not quite. But we're going to need a name. Psychic teleporting dude. Psychic teleport. Who teleports a lot? Obviously. There we go. Gotta be. Even kind of has the pointy ears, right? Done. Get in the box. Still kind of cut up about the magma, but what can you do? R and Jesus decided. Right, that makes this area three. a map. Alright, appreciate it. Oh, I meant to bait. Well, whatever, okay. Maybe it's just, maybe we just keep throwing Pokeballs and ignore everything else. tongue, which I guess is probably kind of tanky at least. Its tongue has well-developed nerves that run to the very tip, so it can be deftly manipulated. Sounds very, very lewd. Um, what's the... What's the... Oh, I have the perfect name. Wait. Best HM user in the game, really? Can give, give him pretty much anything. Learn Surf, okay. Uh, I'm thinking Gene, as in Gene Simmons. have stab and all moves, all HM moves. Oh, I guess so. Well, the normal ones anyway, yeah. Gonna take on Fire Red once more, doing a Nuzlocke. Oh, you're starting fresh now. Good luck, buddy. Hope you get the starter you want if you're doing random starter. Who are you hoping for? I reckon Gene is in Gene Simmons. You also got an evolution leveling up knowing rollout. Licky Tongue Evolves. Oh, I did not know that. Four. Super strong, really? Huh, I guess th that bit over to the right and up here would be where it connects then, so it is literally just a tile set. Okay. Do we want to fish here or surf at all? It's a 2 by 3 grid right now. Okay. Yeah, I'm more, I'm more thinking out loud at that point when I'm like, do I want to surf? We're all right for water type, and we can always find water types other places. Let's just risk it this way. 
No, nope. we've seen you, Sunken. Pokemon that appear are based on the number of trees, lakes, and boulders. Interesting. Eh. Eh. Have some mud. Yeah. Go away. Alright, I'm just gonna run. Different patch of grass, maybe? That's a different zone. This patch. Reckon this is the lucky one. It is not the lucky one. See, if we'd gone... I don't know. If we'd got the hop up here... Wishes were fishes. Maybe this is the lucky one. I think I'm going to try the water. Don't be a tentacle. Well, actually, it's fine if it is. But... Marrow? Alright. Not a huge fan, but... Ran away. Cool. Okay. Five. Music change as well. Helps make it clear. This is this is the fifth block. Um since it's obvious there's no specific names. I am kinda tempted to catch another Magnemite, but I know I shouldn't. We had an Onyx. Well, I mean, we'll see if we get a Geo, dude. Uh, yeah, we've had Onyx. We traded it, but we had it. We haven't got Machop, but we have got Machoke. None of that. What about this bit of grass? Hmm. Can't find anything at all new in here. I am very, very tempted to catch another Magnemite. But hopefully we can find something fresh. even water on this this tile oh 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 that's cool yeah Kangas can I'll take that if I can mm, gotta be hard isn't it Damn it. I didn't think it was going to happen. Right, next. Wait. 
Where's that? Oh, there is grass in this one. Wait, this isn't the first one, is it? No, this is not the first one. Because we came in from the south. Could you still have a Nido Queen? Please catch it. Please. Be kind. Poison hidden in its small horn is extremely potent. Even a tiny scratch can have fatal results. Alright. Um. I'm thinking. What's what's the woman who played the, the Black Widow in the Marvel? Um. Scarlett Johansson, right? Or did the character have a name? Or has anyone got any better ideas? Any names? Throw them out now. Uh, and I guess try and work out what level we want to evolve this at. Well, get it to be... I need a Reno first. Wait, I need a Reno. I need a Reno. What about... That was it, right? We'll go with that. We can live with that. Now, is that it? We've done a full lap now. Yeah, we came in here. I guess we're done. If it is indeed two by three. Log with pure art. Let's have a look. <laughs> yeah, that's accurate. That's accurate. I would have loved the magma, but still no Geo dude. You are correct, but I feel like we're not allowed um, because it's not required to progress, right? Because the Safari Zone wasn't even in gold originally. Um, and we caught in this area, or at least we failed to catch in this area. That was our fated magma. I think we just gotta let it go. Oh yeah, he's probably in here. This is this is the first bit of grass, but. I know, but we can only catch the first one we, we, we encounter. That's why I'm like... Screw it. Go on. Suppose if we're not using it in any way, shape or form, we can release it and it pops right up for us. Alright, well I really can't. We have to even get it out of the box. Potentially wasting an otherwise really good name for somebody in the future here, but redacted. Damn it. <laughs> Literally everywhere now.
just lets them go. I suppose it's like fishing for fun and just letting them go. Still. Showing the geo dude. Is there a computer in here? No, we've got to go outside. And then we'll reconsider who we're leveling up, etc. Not you. Still a bit salty about the magma. We could finally add a fire type. Never get a fire type in a Nuzlocke. Uh, right. First things first. You're going down there. What's the odds we got? <sighs> Abra. Kadabra's pretty cool, but is it. Could we really take a Kadabra to the end without the ability to evolve it? You reckon Licky Tongue's pretty good? You are definitely coming with us. Geodude's just getting in the box. Or getting kicked out, rather. As soon as this is done. Let's do that. Let's also do that just right now. What was the nature? Modest. And we'll also become poison ground, right? ground would be nice. Two tests. Alright, it's not even ready. I can get rid of the Geodude now, right? It's out of here. Gone. Um. Pretty much gotta take you. Where's I assume Hoppip can't let him fly. No, probably not. So we'll keep we'll keep Fruit Shoot with us for now, just for the flight. Uh, okay. We have more leveling up to do, I guess. Don't know where's best to go and do that. Fact. Fact. I guess we can start heading like east of Equitique. Uh, yeah. Did a Nuzlocke once on Platinum. Capture 28 Cricketune to get a metronome. And release them all. Did you break the rules or was it okay? Um, I mean, as long as you're consistent with the rules. That Geodude is now gone, so we don't have to worry about it. If anyone asks, it never happened. I'm going to the toilet real quick Oof. and then we will continue and head up towards Lake of Rage ish I guess um, we now have surf at least so we can go that way anyway Didn't use them in battle. I, 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 I say, as long as you're consistent. 
It's your own rules anyway, it's all purely optional. Um, but yeah, let's see. I think... No, I couldn't catch on this side. Potions. I can sell the revive as well. Oh, and also... Alright. You're lowest. We're going to stick you up front for now. Something like that. Okay. Wait, there wasn't anything else, was there? No. Okay. Me just wanted something different following me for a bit. Let's sell that revive. Go on, Zoe. Paralyzed heals, don't I? Probably also some burns at this point. Uh, don't quite have enough. Never mind. Antidotes were alright. Don't have enough money for that. Okay. Well, then it is what it is. Unless we fly back to mom, of course, but kind of leaving her with her money for when we want to look at buying things like TMs or a shit ton of heal items before the Elite Four, one or the other. Right, I think I popped into this cave, right? Mount Mortar. Let's double check. I don't think I ever caught an Ilex Forest, apparently. Mount Mortar, yes, we caught a Rattata. Okay, that's fine. So it's in here. This is Route 42. I don't think we ever caught on here. Don't think I ever wrote it in either. No, okay. So we could go out into that water. And in fact, I think we will. Wait. Careful. There is a route that connects to the first route. What? It's the second I caught a Pokemon. that connects to the first route. I was in a route over the other side. I haven't caught a Pokemon over this side. And down. Oh, down here. Yeah, obviously this loops back around to the start. But I haven't caught here. Now, that's a while off anyway. But yeah, I've kept notes of every route that we've caught on. Uh, but yeah, looking at the map, I'm wondering if there's grass over there. And if we can go through. We're probably going to end up surfing anyway, but if we surf in here, we've already caught. Something on 46. Oh, right at the start, maybe, yeah. Uh... 
Mm, if I did, then I somehow didn't write it down. No. Not from my records, at least. Let's double kick. Glad I didn't run away. When does Scarjo evolve? I feel like... Can't be far off, right? Oh, wait. 46. That one. I don't think it did technically count as 46. I've got 29. And then 30. Thirty-one, Dark Cave, thirty-two. Dark Cave can come out there. Interesting. But yeah. Let's go there first. More rats has, please. We can deal with them. Bruises is poison. It's even worth it. It is not. Uh, sure. Going there. What a dick. Slam. Slam all the dirt. Or we just hit ourselves. Either works. Beautiful. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It is really not worth doing that. We are getting no XP for these. Alright. Hint about the unknown, I guess. Um, I'm just going to switch you. Oh, that's looking like the way to go. Survivor. Right back down. Like it's just about worth killing for one Pokemon, but splitting that XP. Should one shot like everything in here. Oh, trainer. Okay, maybe it is worth. Let's just top up. Probably going to be low level though, right? We could have been here a while ago. Uh huh. Oh shit! Oh, never mind. All right, I saw Nido King and was like, "What the fuck?" It's level seventeen. Uh, we are still getting you out though. Poison, ground, flying.
grass? No, poison's good against grass. Could do Coraline, Surf. He's got the levels at the very least. Alright. Flying type move randomly, wouldn't guess that. It drowned. Wait, does that mean must evolve at level 17 then? Or at the latest. Or the person's cheating. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Bye-bye. Can get it level 16, okay. Yeah, I, I, I knew it's Moonstone to the Queen or King, but I didn't know what level um, the in-between evolution was. I suspected it was around where it's at. Just didn't know for sure. Okay. Poison versus fighting? No. Not so much. Flying would be good, but our flyer is here as a token thing. I actually meant to take him off the team her off the team. Wow, actually just noticed we only have one dude left on the team. That's crosswave. Impressive how that's ended up. Is it worth us getting Nido Queen at 17? Possibly worth it just for the stats, to be honest. Um, get slammed. Sixty-nine, giggity. All right. Well, Scarjo evolves now, at any rate. It's very tempting. Yeah, I think I'm just going to do it, though. I don't want to lose another one. Without even... You know what I mean? I think we just live with it. Last chance. Anyone? Going... Going. Danzo. Imagine if I just pressed cancel now to stop it evolving. I assume I wouldn't get the moonstone back. Oh, you can't stop it. Alright, makes sense. Well, she now looks way cooler following us as well. Trade Evos you can't stop. Really? That's... I wouldn't have guessed that, though. Stones make sense, but trades... Guess it doesn't want to listen to you. Offered doses off. Modest in nature. Um, okay. Fairly tanky. Anything fun to teach it? Her. Focus Punch. Rock Tomb. Can learn Surf. Good to know. Yeah. <laughs> um, tempting. In fact, I could do it now. I don't know where the move tutor is though to remove it because HMs are a pain aren't they um, I always dislike that I wish you could just overwrite them normally drain punch is special 
it isn't uh wait no that's physical right that's special I mean, Frankie could also learn it, but Frankie's probably going to learn plenty of fighting moves anyway. Mrs. Blast. As in Focus Blast, you mean? I think I'm going to do it. We really don't need Tail Whip. Focus Miss. Okay. Sure. We'll lose that. Anything else? Oh, yeah? Modest works out for us. I wonder. I reckon she can. Do we just go for it? Like, right now? Hang on. Give me a sec. Don't mind that. Oh shit, wait. <laughs> uh, sure. Just getting my, uh, I downloaded it. <laughs> so I just have it there. Yeah, it does seem worth. Um, I was just gonna see what ghost is strong against in particular. Ghost is super effective on Ghost and Psychic. But she'll be poisoned, so I won't really be sending her against Psychic. Uh, but it's not ineffective against a great deal of things, by the looks of it. Ineffective against Steel, Dark... Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Well, that's it. That's it. We have Focus Blast. And eventually, Earthquake and then, like, a good poison move. Possibly toxic, but possibly not. All right. Better not die in, like, the next fight or something, because I'll get really pissed off. you in a fight. Earth power level 43. Special earthquake. Oh yeah, of course, because earthquake's physical. Alright. Oh, this is strength, isn't it? We can't do that yet. Try it. 
funsies. It hits! It's dead. Beyond dead. <laughs> Funny though. It's not waste out on Geodudes anymore. At least she can get her own XP now though, is the other thing. Because still, until we get the XP share, it's going to be a bit rough. Okay, I really don't have enough Focus Blast to do this every time. Body Slam 23, that sounds good. Yes. I like that. Yeah, yeah. Body Slam strong. Also going up. Also, both sides go up. This is still Mount Mortar, though. And that's surfable, I assume. I don't know why, I thought two evolutions, it might suddenly be a good move. No, no, that's not how that works. Screw it. <laughs> it hits again! There's power, shadow ball, focus, and sludge bomb. Sludge bomb's probably good, yeah. I assume that's special. Can we go and get that TM somewhere? That sounds like one we can buy. Okay, we can't jump in the water. Oh, wait, hang on. Hey. Free money. I love that we now have an Ido Queen following us. I'm going to be real. I was pretty bummed out after losing all the Pokemon multiple times. But now... The Safari Zone really helped us rekindle. I'm still trying to decide if we take a Kadabra with us. My mom's account, welcome. Uh, I hope not, but welcome anyway. How's it going? Shadow Ball. Route 43 given by the guard in the tall building after defeating Team Rocket. Okay. Alright, sounds good. Wait, can we already go and get that? Or is it defeating, defeating Team Rocket, like clearing out their base? What's wrong with you being on your mom's account? You shouldn't have access to your mom's account. Although I'd be kind of impressed that your mom's on Twitch. <laughs> How's it going anyway? What's up? What's up? Welcome. You're Team Rocket. Team Rocket fan. Pokemon fan. No idea. Part of the game history. Okay. Well, I'll keep an eye out. I'd like to think a poison type would learn at least one more poison type move. It's an Ido Queen, that is. Empoleon. Empoleon. Oh, yeah, I've seen that one. That's pretty sick. Was that Sun Moon? No, before then. The Blue War Greymon. Actually, yeah, I can see it. I can see it. Um, not to knock it, though. I remember War Greymon looking sick. Digimon was always way cooler than Pokemon. Cartoons. Don't know about the games. I hear Cyber Sleuth is uh, pretty good. But I've not really interacted with them. I never even had like one of the little Digivice things. Like the original Digimon game, right? 
Diamond Pearl. Maybe I'll get it when we reach that gem. Ether. Alright. So I think we've, we're done in Mount Mortar until we get strength and or things like Waterfall. Watch a lot of the Pokemon show on Cartoon Network. It's where you learned English. Oh, okay. Interesting. Where are you from, if you don't mind me asking? What is your native language? It's quite interesting because there was a period where I think a lot of... Um, a lot of uh, India and Pakistan in particular were practicing their English listening to friends back in the day. And so a lot of call centers located in the region, they all sounded like that type of New York American. Island? Wait. I don't, I don't recognize that flag at all. Do you call rice balls donuts? Actual donuts are great. Don't know about rice balls. Just kill it. Oh, it's Icelandic for Iceland. Oh, okay. Alright. That's cool. Not far away, then. Yeah, some nice HP. Doesn't look like much, and then I remembered, like, it's level 18. <laughs> really good at flags. I am not. I'm generally pretty poor at geography uh, on the whole. Ghost on fighting is... okay, whatever. Shadow ball it is then. You must, uh, you must enjoy Eurovision then. The Olympic opening ceremony. I don't even know the names of most of those countries. I remember the first time I heard Bosnia and Herzegovina, I'm like, that's not a real place. Stop lying to me. What's the name of the guy who does Eurovision um, in the UK commentary? Terry Wogan. I was like, you're lying to me, Terry. You love Eurovision. I, I, I'm not really a fan of pop music or that kind of thing. Although I did, I did appreciate Lordy. Wait, were they Iceland? They were Iceland, weren't they? Or were they Norway? I know they were Scandinavian. Could have been Sweden. Lordy was Finland. Okay. I was saying my geography's awful. I was like, somewhere up there. <laughs> Let's heal a bit. Finland isn't Scandinavia. Well, again, again, I opened up with my geography is atrocious. Um, there are a great many things I don't know, and geography is right up there. <laughs> I really don't. Yeah. At least I'm proving my point. I once I once tried to take a car journey from the north of England to the, to the Midlands. Uh, accidentally did a lap, a loop around Leicester, which is in the middle of the country. Uh, went all the way around it. Nearly did it twice. This was before I had Google Maps on my phone and in-car navigation. And I can read a map, but if you don't know where you are... Uh, it's a Nordic country. Denmark, Norway, Sweden, and Scandinavia, Iceland, Finland, and Nordic, but not Scandinavian. Oh, okay. I think I've been muddying up the two in my mind. Denmark, Norway, Sweden. No. Denmark, Sweden. I don't know. I don't know. I really should just get a map or a globe or something and pay attention to it someday. <laughs> Nordics are like a family. Like the UK, <laughs> for now. Well, not even at this point. Um, anyway. Anyway, what are we doing about a Zubat? Shadow Ball? Because why not? Oh, 
I wonder if Lordy is still going. Probably. A lot of bands that I think are probably dead are actually still going just on a much smaller scale. Right, 42 we never caught on, did we? So we have grass here and a fisherman. And we can sail and get that. Lordy are still going. Nice. Because I, I thought about the darkness a while back and I was like, I bet I haven't heard from them for years, right? It's like, nope, they're still touring. Mareep. I'm pretty happy with Mareep. Level 13 as well. Your entry this year was very popular with Europe. Oh, yeah? We can Thunder Wave, right? Yeah. Your country or neighbor country speak a different language, only communicate to business. Where's... Th oh, Brazil, right? Spiro? No. I thought most of South America spoke... I don't know. I apologize, you probably told me. Oh, well, I'm right, okay. Uh, I daren't attack with anything. I'm worried anyone would kill it. Uh, actually, we could probably go back to ScarJo and scratch. At least once, right? Don't speak Spanish. I thought it was Portuguese, right? How do all the countries around you speak Spanish? Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to throw ScarJo out. Apologies, knocking the mic again. We sent a band called Hatari, and if you think Bjork is weird, I have something to tell you. I can't say I really listen to much Bjork. Please live. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay. Damn it. Well, okay, whatever. We can scratch again. Doesn't affect me. Ground type, nerd. We can get Ampharos. We can actually get Ampharos. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, screw it. <laughs> Spiro! I think it might have survived on a crit anyway. I did consider it. Atari are a bunch of crazies, but you love them. I'll have to... I'll have to check them out sometime. In fact, let me... I'm just going to load up. I'm not going to play it right now. If I load up Spotify, Hatari are on there. That's an interesting picture on their bio. Okay. I'll, I like the guy's face mask with the spikes. Um, I'll check them out. Right. We're going to need a name. Anybody got a name? Mareep. If static electricity builds in its body, its fleece doubles in volume. Touching it will shock you. He isn't wearing one, that's how he looks. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, it's an interesting body mod then. Now, it could be kind of obvious, but I do I do like... Um, I need to say Rick and Morty. Wallace and Gromit. So we could go for Sean, as in Sean the Sheep. Um... I'm going to put it in now. If anyone else has a better suggestion, throw it out. Um, but I'm feeling Sean. Sean, who may be coming onto the team. I can put some Icelandic in the chat if I want. Um, I'm not overly bothered, but I won't understand a word of it. And probably no one else will. Um, Joey. No, he's the Ratata. Oh god. Can I just defeat can I just delete? I can't delete, can I? Damn it. I wasn't actually trying to get into a fight right there. Just wanted to get out of the grass. Yeah, that looks like some Viking shit. I'm uh, I'm considering putting armed guards outside my outside my house right now. I didn't even heal the paralysis on ScarJo. 
Amphros is a sheep with dragon blood. This is the reason it loses its wool when it evolves. Oh yeah. I'm all right. I'll I'll just continue not understanding a word of it. <laughs> that is the reason why Mega Amphros is a dragon type. There's a Mega Amphros. I did not know this. I think we throw Salad Fork out. She's not seen some love in a while. I wish I had a flying type. Said something very nice. Yeah, that sounds like the Twitch chat I know. Always cuddles and sunshine. Spear on the daycare, come back to him on the Elite Four, he will not disappoint. <laughs> I could do, I could go and put Spearow in there. Not necessarily a bad choice at all. Ah, okay. Thank you, appreciate it. Um... Kind of hoping for a, a lowland dog trio there. The whole handsome look. We stop. Still no chance. Again, I guess I could have gone this way a lot earlier. Um, wait, should I have done Lake of Rage before now? Am I going to be over leveled? I don't know. Austin Wall. Hoi, Volcamo. I also don't speak don't speak Portuguese Spiro. I did spend a lot of time talking to Portuguese people growing up. Um, thanks to our Jedi Academy clan. Had multiple Portuguese in. We really hated when somebody called them Spanish. I guess that's a nationalist thing. But yeah. Paralyzed, there we go. Showing off. I'm showing off all the time with my powerful English. You know a lot of Polish people. I know a lot of Polish people. Um, pretty much all I know is Polish swear words, though. Generally seem more than happy to teach people those. But yeah. Polish people travel around. I know quite a lot that I know uh, here in the UK are starting to go back now. Um, this is a fated fight right here. Poison. We had a good ground move. Eh, we'll do that. Scarjo, she could take it, but she's running low on PP and uh, let's not make it any more awkward than we have to. We'll just Dragon Rage it. Yeah, kill that. I think we all learned that one. I know Chesh. Hello. Hello. But beyond that, I'm like, eh, alright. Slam. Do it. Oh no. Wanna learn Russian for meme purposes. I had like a single lesson of Russian growing up, because our German teacher also knew Russian. Uh, 
I remember almost none of it. Why is Shed Skin not working? I think I pre pretty much just remember Privyet. I have a friend who knows pretty good Russian, um, just happens to be a nuclear scientist, nuclear physicist. I'm fairly sure there's a link there. Commie bastard. Um, but yeah. Tried learning on Duolingo. One of my early sentences was Ukraine is here, Russia is over there. Wow. How do you even tell? W what's the difference between the two? Insert meme picture of show me the difference between these two and it's it's the office one, isn't it? They're the same thing. Yeah, that kind of got hushed and forgot about very, very quickly. I don't really follow the mainstream news. I feel like that's not been in it for a while. Zero to two turns to heal. Oh, okay, it's not always the same turn. Cool, good to know. Um, yeah, I don't know what the best way of learning a foreign language is nowadays. Is Rosetta Stone still a thing? What poison, right? Water poison. I reckon just cross wave again. Oh god. I believe there are like 20 million Polish peeps all over the world. Fun fact that may not still be a fact, but it was when I learned it at least. Um, there are more Irish people outside Ireland than within it. <laughs> Irish also, fans are travelling. There's a rest. Imagine using rest, getting healed automatic every turn. I guess so. Oh, yeah! Shit, yeah, that makes sense. Because it can learn rest. Rest, automatically wake up. Yeah, that, that'd be... That'd be good. Why not let me do the broken stuff? Beer potatoes and Jacksepticeye. Wonder what the truth of that is? I imagine, actually, I Ireland's greatest export is uh, Amazon to the rest of the EU. Isn't that where they have their base? I know when I send any returns to Amazon, they all go back to Ireland. Cream PewDiePie. God, do I hate PewDiePie. Um, I think I've seen a bit of Jacksepticeye. Seems all right. We have God himself. What, PewDiePie or Jack? Oh. No? Can I get up there? Can I, wait, can I not? Stefan Carl Stefansson. Doesn't ring a bell. Uh, now there's a chance it's going to have a random flying move like Peck. Which makes me not want to send Salad Fork in, but she is the best option. Dude who played Robbie Rotten. Also not very familiar. I, I know who he is, but I, I never watched Crazy Town. Was it? Horn Drill, one hit KO. Wait, really? Shit. Spiro. Shit. Um... I hate that they exist. <laughs> Horn Drill and Fisher. Alright. Lazy Town. Is that what I said? Not really. I, I, I'm sure I've seen them, but the show means nothing to me. Oh, now I'm worried. Wait. It's wild, right? Fuck this. Damn. Crit hit. Fuck's sake. Number one memes from Lazy Town. Is it though? Is that number one meme? Or is Dio number one meme?
don't know what meme ranking you're going to, but mine mine begins and ends with Jojo. Uh, I don't fucking know. Rock Blast? Flail's fighting, right? Oh, God damn it. You know what? Wait, I am number one is a meme, a music meme. Oh, I don't know then. I do not know this meme. Wait, how many aura? I only have three. Okay. We are number one. Sure. I mean, do I want you to? Not necessarily, but I'll check it out. <gasps> Wait. Oh, I can't catch it anyway. Uh... I'm not here for you. Go away. Bye. I mainly just wanted these uh which reminds me I do still need to go back and visit Kurt. That wasn't yellow, that was clearly orange. Is this one blue? Wrong vid, he says. As if I'm not smart enough to have something that's gonna... Gonna show me what the video is on a thumbnail. Nice try, though. I, I'm pleased to see that we're still trying to rickroll people in 2019. Let's keep this one going forever. Hang on. Let's do that. I will have to teach you how to be villains. Okay. All right. Sure. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, buddy. That that's enough of that one. Yeah, I think that one's just gonna fly over my head without knowing the original reference. It's fine. There's plenty of memes in the world. I don't know why I saved there. It doesn't hurt, I guess. Mm, nothing. Wait. On the water? We can't catch it anyway. Wait, do they always go second? Anyway. Oh, go away, Goldine. I honestly have no idea how I get that item. But stay there for now, I guess. Mahogany. Just a souvenir shop. Nothing suspicious, indeed. Definitely no aerial poking out of that tree. Black Cape Sephiroth? Sephiroth here. Or at least a Genova clone. A Sephiroth clone, sorry. 
one one of the one of the number clones. Anyone else excited for the remake? I'm kind of I don't know. It looks good and I'm looking forward to playing it, but I'm also not looking forward to the game being split into like four parts at full price each over the course of what, half a decade? Optimistically, a full decade more realistically. I don't know. As if there's not a hundred percent chance I'm gonna buy and play them all day one anyway, but still. Let's I want the marry. So we're taking the marry. Right there. It is bashful. Does have Thundershock though. Be more of a more of a special attacker. Okay. Someone else to level up. In fact. Not necessarily a bad stretch of water to be doing that in, if we go back a bit, is it? Uh, okay. Okay, so what's everyone's all-time number one favourite meme then? Rick Rowling's got to be up there. I kind of always liked Epic Sax Guy. It's harmless and, I don't know, kind of dig the tune. I've managed to avoid the vast majority of the actual nasty ones, though. Pretty happy about that. Yeah, I want to get Sean leveled up a bit because there's a certain somebody we're going to have to fight and kill that she's going to be, he's going to be four times effective on. Oh, I see. There's mountain climbing thing there. 21. Well, you're not fighting this one. Let's not risk it. Even with 10 level difference, I'm not risking random heck or something. Probably wouldn't be enough to deal the actual damage now to uh, Salad Fork, but still. It's Dragon Rage. Gonna be a couple, right? Huh? Are you serious? Okay. It's not gonna no pursuit. Random crits. I don't know, probably that. Joys are splitting that XP three ways. There we go, that's more like it. Normal, right? How was that about? Did like 12, 12 damage. All right. Don't pull any punches. that. Can't be bothered going back quite yet. Do more goldines. That'll do. So it goes what? 
Marie, Flaffy, and for us, right? It's only level 13. We've got a ways to go. God damn it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Punch yourself. Punch yourself. Good. Perfect. Let's try again. Ooh. Okay, well, we get a kill at least. No, we don't. Don't even dare leave him in. Yeah, whatever. Sure. Not taking any missed chances. Might it be better to go up and just kill some Magikarp? No, because there'll also be Gyarados in the lake, won't there? Yeah, let's not do that quite yet. go east. No, we can't. Rage candy bar, 300. No. Should I go up? I don't know. Right. That's how it's going to be for a bit, I'm afraid. We, we, we do need to get some of these levels up. In fact, I'm still trying to decide if we take... Psychic's useful, but not super useful. I don't know who we'd take out either. Frankie, maybe. Scarjo has Focus Punch, Focus Blast. Mm, don't know. Some sea kings, ideally. Better XP. There we go. Ask and ye shall receive. Um, right. Can we take it? Thundershot. You missed. Kind of thinking maybe I should have thunder waved. Alright, it's wasting turns. Increases water's effectiveness. No, it weakens fire. Alright. Seems kind of useless. At least we go first now as well. Oh shit. Alright. Take those. stuff. Hey, there we go. Get that stat boost. Mm. 
All right. A little bit more. Amphros is going to be a ways off, isn't it? I'm going to say late 20s, early 30s. Oh, 25. I'm not going to risk it, but... That's fine. Wasn't sure if one attack was the flying one. That's Peck. Bye bye. Mm, I'm trying to think if it's worth just going and doing Lake and Rage, Lake of Rage first, so we can get the XP share. Probably going to need these Pokemon to do it, including Sean. We'll have it for later, at least. We probably won't all be equal level, let's be honest. Can I, can I be bothered grinding for another 15 levels on Sean right now? Tough call. Daniel Dunkers, we are indeed nuzlocking. Uh, in fact, there we go. Welcome as well. Welcome. You brought snacks, right? You were meant to bring snacks. You do know. Doritos, dip. Sweets. A bit of chocolate. Donuts. You brought the donuts, right? These are the donuts. You know, otherwise I might have to send you back to the shops. No, you're going to go get a sandwich. Found the mobile user. Don't know why... Uh, Autocomplete loves Finna. Don't know if that means anything in any language, but... Yeah, found a mobile user. <laughs> How's it going? What sandwich? Kind of want a sandwich now. It's Thunder Wave. Damn it. We're going to tag out. I'm not dealing with this. Going to hit herself. Yeah, there we go. Going good playing Platinum. It's definitely officially a thing at this point of people that love playing Pokemon while watching Pokemon streams. Oh, there's any problem with that, of course, but... In fact, Spearow, were you playing? Is it Platinum you're playing? I oh, know Chris is playing Platinum, I know that. Is that 3DS or normal DS? I don't know, I can't remember what dip, what change which, to be honest, anymore. Hopefully playing through them will help. DS. I did pick a random starter. Otherwise, I would have picked a fire type, because that's just how I roll. Yeah, based off, based off the, what you call it, last digit of the trainer ID. That's how we do it. One, two, three is grass. Four, five, six, fire. Seven, eight, nine, water. And zero, my pick, which basically means it's also fire. Slightly too high a level. Staying safely. Pick Totodile. I had a friend that always picked the water types. Always put me at an inherent disadvantage when we would fight. Which we did since Gen 1. My Charizard getting beasted by his Blastoise. Totodile, I don't know. I, I really don't... I'm not a huge fan of the Cyndaquil line, though, in, in Gen 2. As much as I love the fire types. You know what? For the sake of not having to go back. Let's do that. Don't always pick water. Mostly whatever starter you like best. It's fair. It's fair. this story before of course but um I'll still never forget my first first Pokemon team back in blue which is the first one I had original blue um, 
because of the show and whatnot, I ended up trying to run a team entirely of fire types because that's how trainers work, right? Even in the game, they all seem to have just one type for the most part, except for Gary, who should have been the obvious person to teach me better than that. But got as far as the Elite Four. Didn't get much further. Charmander, strong choice. Totodile, Tor I do like Torchic. Pimple up, that goes into the Empyreon, isn't it? We had somebody saying how much they liked that earlier. Slivy, Slivy's pretty cool. And then after that, I have no real idea. Rowlet was, that was the Grass Owl, right? I think when I saw TFS do Sun Moon, that's the one they used, I think. God, I haven't watched them in ages. I assume TFS gaming is still a thing. Just don't have time for that anymore. All my time is spent elsewhere is probably more accurate. Did we try and take this Goldeen? Level 20. Three level difference. I think we can do it. Thunder Wave though. Stop it! Wow, okay. Oh, thus making my next move completely useless. There we go. You know what? You know what? We're just, we're just, no. We're just getting out of there. Cross wave you're in. But yeah, um, even if it's boring and outplayed, I, I love Charizard, but then I'm a bit of a dragon fan. So there is that. Even if it makes life hard, like for 15, 20 years, I, I tried to make a good Magic the Gathering dragon deck, which when you're basing it around creatures that have seven plus mana cost. It doesn't work very well. I have managed to do it now, kind of, but it's expensive and awkward. And only really works in Commander. God, I haven't played Magic in ages. Did the Nidoran die? The, me the Nidorino died. Um, we've got a female Nidoran now, though. Or got. We've evolved it now. We have Nido Queen. Welcome back, Sharkers. I meant to run away. Run away. But yeah, ScarJo's down there. Just in the bottom right. Just kind of leveling up Flaffy at the moment. Yeah. Sean. I think it's off our better stat. What starter did you get, Sharkers? You went to start Fire Red Nuzlocke, right? My memory's awful, so I apologise, but I feel like you said Fire Red Nuzlocke starting. Let's go heal. Still doing it. You just started though, didn't you? What what starter, or did you just pick rather than randomize it? Let's keep going. We still need more levels, more recovery. As I say, I kind of want everyone around 30. We've had to replace a lot. Well, we can easily deal with that. I'd like to think. Turns out this is the one that knows Horn Drill. Back with Sandwich. Where? I don't see a Sandwich. Daniel, you, you're, you're a constant source of dis disappointment. Um. <laughs> Mail it. Can you? That's a bit slow. Can you not like push it in the Ethernet port? Do you have a disk drive? Ideally floppy disk because you know sandwiches are quite soft and floppy. <laughs> just push it in there. Um, small print. 
I am not responsible for damage to hardware as a result of trying to force sandwiches into it. But please send pick on Discord if you do. Thunder wave. I should resist that, right? Nope. More worrying, of course, would be if the sandwich then came out of my Ethernet port. I would be wholly unprepared for it. One day we'll get Star Trek uh, replicators, and then we'd actually be able to do that shit. What is my final team going to be? Oh, I have no idea. You say it as if I have any, any say in the matter. As I click that, I was like, if this misses, it could be dead. I mean, honestly, ideally, I'd have, like, a Houndoom or Houndour. I forget which one's which. Uh, Tyranitar, which I guess would give me two Dark types, but still. Um, God damn it. Back we go. Ampharos was also in my original Pokemon Gold team. Do you like Ampharos? You're using Houndoom and Platinum. I haven't seen either of them yet. I don't know. Maybe they're not in the... No. No, maybe they're not in this version? Do I have to trade with my friend Silver to get them? Maybe. I have no idea what the version-specific Pokemon are in any given gen, to be honest. Except maybe the first gen. I know Blue didn't get Growlithe. It got full picks And... Ekans Ekin, instead of something else, right? Anyway. I'm no Pokemon professor. I'm not named after a tree. Houndour is in both versions. Oh, cool. Okay. I've just not encountered it yet. Uh, Thundershot. I may as well Thunder Wave them. Because they're all faster than me anyway. Oh. Yeah. Mm. Yep, that'll do. Use that. Well, hopefully I find a hand now, Hound Hour then. And hopefully also a Lava Tower at some point. Not as slim, but... Something you enjoy is the randomizer. Yeah! I... I... I no interest myself in doing one. Um, I've watched... Fellow streamers do them on occasion, but it doesn't interest me personally. I like just doing them normally. Give some control. That lets you plan to an extent, although I'm going to know virtually nothing of what's coming up in future gens, so little gained person, little gained like for me. Although chat helps with that, of course. Like, I haven't been denying myself from looking stuff up, but I try not to do it too much. I still don't know if, if Coraline can evolve, does evolve. Be a fun surprise if it happens. Um. Have, you, have you done many Nuzlocks then? Also, what was the sandwich? You never told what was in sandwich. God, I'm just gonna make myself hungry. I love a good, love a good turkey stuffing and mayo sandwich myself. Or chicken and bacon. Chicken and bacon's pretty good. Why did I get off? I do love sandwiches. It's such a good food. You can do anything with it. You can be as simple or as extravagant as you want. As long as, as long as, right, this is where I draw the line and I'm very serious about this. The concept, the entire concept and practice of the open sandwich can go fuck itself. Um, a bit of bread with some spread or a bit of ham or whatever on top of it. That's not a sandwich. That's just a bread with some shit you put on it. 
At least put another bit of bread on top. Otherwise, no. Um, get that stuff away from me. I, I, I don't want to hear about it. Fucking open sandwich. Like, like, what smart ass came up with that? Open. Yeah, yeah. Dragonite, Nido Queen, Ampharos, Fero, <laughs> Licky Licky, Tangrowth. Tangrowth? How is Tangrowth? Does Tangela evolve? Do we even. We don't even have a Tangela. And I know why you want. Why you expect Fero there. Licky Licky's an interesting one, though. Not necessarily a bad choice, though. Tangrowth does evolve. Oh, okay. Wait, so you're telling me you expect Salad Fork to die before the end? That's what you're, that's what you're saying. You have little faith. I'd probably take Fruit Shoot before, uh, before Aspiro anyway. Just because it's a Gen 2 Pokemon, I'm trying to take those where I can. Starters die to the craziest of things. Sharkers, you don't have to tell me. That, is, that has happened in at least two out of the three previous attempts. Um, yeah, I've already had a Chikorita get wiped out by a Goldeen Peck on one of the first... In fact, the first Fisherman's Bridge you encounter in the game. Yeah. I was like, oh, well, this will be fine. Chikorita. In fact, it may even have been a bay leaf at that point. Versus a Goldeen. Water type, grass type. Come on. Oh, it knows Peck. Oh, it's flying type. Oh, crit. Great. One shot kill. The rival Crobat will kill it. You reckon? Mean look it and then cross poison. I know what to look out for now, though. I've been warned. That's what you've done. You've just ensured the survival. Thanks to my fantastic memory and strategic planning. Sorry, I almost kept a straight face for that. Almost. Get him, Sean. Uh, wait. No, we're okay. Keep going. Tangela evolves when leveled up while knowing ancient power. Okay. Tangela likes some ancient Pokemon then. Is that the lore? It's there with. Is it. Arceus? Arceus? Don't know what the common pronunciation is. Probably doesn't really matter since there's no spoken voice Pokemon game. Wait, no. Latest one has voice. It's the latest Pokemon I've voiceover, Sword and Shield. I actually don't know. I mean, I've never played it, so why should I know, but still. Tangela learns Ancient Power level 33. Forgets it on level 36. What do you mean, forgets it? Why would you forget ancient power? I don't think this is a good one to move. To learn rather, sorry, what? Sharply reducing speed stat. We don't, we don't. I don't even care. Oh, okay, wild ones. Okay, that makes sense. Same, presumably, if you uh, put them in daycare. Ooh, reminds me. We'll, we'll go do that in a second. We'll go put the, uh, put the Spiro in the daycare. Never know, it might become relevant. Well, no, what we need is for Salad Fork to stay alive. We don't need a Tangela. Yeah, 
out our starter. The last time we succeeded, our starter made it to the end. Admittedly, Blastoise is very tanky. Still. That was not bad damage for a level 19 Seeking. Let's go back to the Pokemon Center and get out uh, Fruit Shoot so we can fly. We'll go to Kurt as well. We'll go to Kurt, we'll go to Daycare. Um, I mean, levels aren't everything anyway. I'd rather take the starter than anything else. Plus, Tangela, again, is a Gem 1 Pokemon. Still trying to favor Gen 2 where I can. as well since we're dropping you off. What you reckon put Jean in there too? Got no reason not to really. See you forgot about the Flareon that's obviously gonna be in our final team as well. You're you're going down here. I don't know about EV. Because I want to have some control over the moves. Don't know. I think Spiro and Licky Tongue I can live with though. No, but there's the person I can fight on the other day, right? And I think I've done that before, and then the Flareon died, admittedly, but still. Hmm. It's up here, right? South of Goldenrod. to read that on her. Ah, he was killing. We have Flaffy now indeed. We do. We have an electric type again. I'm pretty happy about that. We haven't lost anybody yet today, so that's a bonus. Yes. So you are taking Master Burb. And Jean. Presumably they can't breed. Okay, we need you back in. And you. Uh, get there. Woot woot! Yeah, we have an Ido Queen. That happened. Safari Zone was very kind to us. Also, we missed out on a magma, but overall, uh, pretty happy. Azalea, right? I think that's where Kurt is. Get whatever the hell Falls is making at the moment. I don't know. I don't know. I'll get him in a bit. In fact, I'll get him now. You don't, Mom. We did indeed. 
never heard that nickname before, but I like it. Lure balls. They're for bugs and water types, right? Hooked by a rod. Okay, never mind. Net balls are the ones I was thinking of. That's right. What color do we give him this time? Licky tongue learns roll out 33. If he gets at 49. Okay. So we need to get a licky tongue out before 49. Greens or whites? Whites are right there. Yeah, green I reckon. Not going to say no to free Pokeballs, right? Uh, right, where were we? We were training. And grinding. Green are friend balls. What do friend balls do? a better stretch of water to train in. Not really. Usually you sell the old man balls on the market for a quick cash. You don't care. Giggity. You're taking the old man's balls. And... Okay, yeah, Alright. If you want to handle them. I wouldn't, personally. Saggy old man balls, but... However you get your money, I'm, I'm not going to question it. Makes them start with higher friendliness. Ah, that makes sense. That makes sense. You're there. You're in here. No, no, it's not illegal as long as the old man is agreeing. <laughs> as long as he knows what he's signing up for. It's whatever floats your boat. No judging. Um. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Killin. That that is that is perfect. Good response. <laughs> I'm trying to remember what that's from. Because I've used that before. <laughs> is it Future Armor? No. South Park? No. Don't know. Was it TFS? Could have been. Oh, wait, as in Dragon Ball Abridged. Possible. Was it like Teen Gohan or something? Sounds right to me. I'd probably need to catch up on some of their... FF7 Machine Abridged stuff. I, I still watch the TFS like Abridged stuff. There's less time for their others. Although it's mainly Dragon Ball games, which are mostly naff. There's like currently at least one good Dragon Ball game, and it's a fighting game. And they're not very good at fighting games. They're not awful, but I do like them, guys. Just don't have the time to be watching a lot of people's content. It's like, well, I can watch someone else's or produce my own. But when I'm producing my own, I get to play games. I quite like the playing games part. Just saying. Yeah, that's Thunder Wave. Waiting for the Boo Saga. Always hated the Boo voice and personality. That's... I actually watched Dragon Ball Z. I never... I mean, even back then, I was like, it's fine. It's something to watch, but it's not amazing. Um... But the boost saga just went on so damn long. That's where I dropped off. Um, and I still have no desire to go back and finish watching that. I think I remember as far as Skinny Boo coming out. And then I was like, it's ridiculous. It was, I don't know, like 30 episodes of Gohan training up with a sword. It was all quite silly. And now I'm just sick of seeing Boo because of Kid Boo and fighters. Fucking everywhere. Hmm. 
No. Already confused. Can't do it twice. Kill it. Yeah, dead zone. Should be good XP. EXP. Not the greatest. Thinking about it, actually. Thinking about it, I think those tentacles are giving better XP. And the Mantine as well. We need to fly, though. Excuse me. See, this is why I quite like having Pokemon that knows fly on the team. I really don't know how long Frankie's going to hang on the team as, as pure fighting. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, I, I assume the TFS guys, they're taking a break, aren't they? With, uh, with DB... DB... C? No, Dragon Ball Bridge, whatever. Toriyama wanted to kill the series on Namek with Goku. Too many loose ends and demand for more was high. That's the reason why the Cell Arc existed. Killed Goku with a good excuse. And I went, yeah. Oh yeah, I know I know, I know the deal. Um, the show was meant to end multiple times over, but it just kept getting bigger and bigger, so I had to keep making it. It'd be kind of daft not to, to be honest, but um, it's a problem that's plagued, plagued multiple shows and anime and whatnot over the years. Victim of their own success. It's like, uh... What's it? Neon Genesis Evangelion. Relevant again, thanks to being on Netflix. Um, forget the name of the guy, the writer, the mangaka. Anyway, famously, by the end of the show, just... Just, just hated it. Just hated it. Hated the fan base in particular. That's why it ends in such a weird way. Made the villain. Oh, has he actually come out and said that? That he officially made them as annoying as possible on purpose? Still people that like that move. I couldn't say why. Also, this is a much more dangerous place to go and go and fight. I shouldn't have done this. I'm immediately full of the regrets. Guess we're going back to the Goldings. Yeah. Yep. Just, just kill it. Just kill it. Um mm hmm. Why um hmm? people seen Neon Genesis? Out of curiosity. I've heard it from Geekdom 101. Don't know if he's a good source. I pass. Yeah, we're giving up on this plan. We're going back to the Goldines. Play it safe with the sheeps. Yes. We're going back to the Goldines. I don't want to lose Flaffy. I'm still, I'm still kind of torn as I'm doing this between going up and doing the whole Lake of Rage thing so I can get the XP share, which makes the grinding easier. But, like, Sean in particular are going to be super useful for the Red Gyarados, so, amongst other things. I feel like it's about level 40 as well. Maybe, oh no, it could be lower. 40 sounds a bit high now, I'll say it out loud. Or is it? I don't know, should I have come here a long time ago, maybe? Don't forget where I need to go. That's why I'm not going into that house yet. Because I know I have to go in there and down and all this other stuff. Do I just go up to the lake now? I'm going to go take a look at that route. Double check. I'll do a bit of... In fact, yeah, I'll do enough grinding here until I need to go back and heal and then I'll probably call it, to be honest. Because I need to finish up. Especially since nobody brought me a sandwich. 
That's my sandwich. Still waiting. Just, just shocking behaviour. Might have a rival battle. Good point. Yeah. Let's make sure if we head out of this town in any way, shape, or form, we've got our solid team with us. His are all going to be at least level 30, aren't they? Probably mid 30s at this point. Stop the waterfalls. There we go. Nearly. You and your doomsaying predictions. What do you think you are, Nostradamus? Okay, we've probably got one more. As water moves keep keep doing a lot of damage to poor poor Sean. Actually, no risks. It's hard to get electric type. Actually, saying that, there's probably like volt orbs and electrodes down in the bit we're going to do shortly, right? Very cool. Have to fight some. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Well, we got we got Marie, but what level thirteen? So it's a good amount of growth. Stick a nice fire type in there, and we're looking all right. Don't know. I don't like having mono types, right? But it is what it is. It's like playing monocolor in magic. Not enough variety. You can specialize, but too many things you can't deal with easily or effectively. Stand by me, Flaffy. We are going to save up, and uh, that is where I'm going to call it today. As I say, I'm going to go get my own sandwich, I guess, or maybe some actual dinner. 4 a.m. start to suck. But hey, oh, I used to pretty much, oh dear, get a lift load on a Sunday. Stick some music on, listen to a podcast, do my own shit. It's not too bad. Um, enjoy the rest of your day, folks. I. Probably back on tomorrow afternoon. We'll see how knack. God's sake, Jack. If your opponent is flying, your twister becomes more powerful. As in twister the dragon move. Interesting. I did not know that. Is that true? I guess it must be. Um, yeah. Might be back tomorrow. Not sure. Either way, almost certainly will be back uh, on Monday. Pokemon. I, I, I don't know. Weekends I feel like playing something else, but we've got a lot of grinding to do. So I don't know. M maybe tomorrow I just jump on for a bit of grinding and we can chill and hang out or whatever. Might even. In fact, that's a point. Sound. Okay, there's no option to like turn down the music. It probably is in the DS, though. Wait, what was that? I think I found a fast forward button. That might be useful. <laughs> I'll bear that in mind. Anyway, enjoy the rest of your weekend, folks, if I don't see you again before the end of it. Until the next time, I have been Pete, aka Crimson. Thank you very much for hanging out. Have a good one. <laughs>